In this video, we are going to make lentil vegan pasta alfredo. Sure to be a favorite. We are going to start with boiling our water to prepare for our lentil pasta. I like to use red lentil pasta. You can use any one ingredient pasta that you choose. So it's going to be very important. When you look at the ingredient list, it's only going to have one ingredient. There's no preservatives. There's no crap, no concentrated, refined, and processed foods in there. So I like to use this. So I'm going to heat my water, and then I just cook your, your pasta according to directions. So we're going to start with one cup of cooked cauliflower. And you can buy a head of cauliflower if you want. I use a lot of cauliflower when I'm cooking. So I opted for this diced, chopped, riced cauliflower that's already ready. And I am going to cook this. I'm going to boil this in water and cook it up, just a little bit extra. So for garlic, you can use cloved garlic, like raw garlic, or for time purposes, you can buy minced garlic already ready to go. And this recipe asks for three cloves of minced garlic. A half a teaspoon of your diced garlic in your jar equals one clove. So we're going to add three cloves. One, two, three, and we're just going to saute this. Now, when you're sauteing without oil, when you go plant-based, we don't use oil. It's just a saturated fat, unnecessary calories. So we don't use oil. So if you needed something instead of oil to saute your vegetables with, you could use a little bit of water, but we won't need that for this recipe either. Cauliflower's cooking and it is done. So it needs to be drained. You're going to put all your ingredients in your food processor, your Vitamix, your blender. We're going to add two cups of mushrooms. And if you mess up and you put your mushrooms in the blender, take them out and saute them. It's no big deal. It's just we've got the cooked cauliflower in there. I've got my mushroom sauteing. I am going to add just a touch of this vegetable broth because I let it sit there a little bit long without stirring it. But you can see as soon as you add a little vegetable broth or water, it doesn't stick. Add the cooked cauliflower, a cup of our vegetable broth, and a fourth of a cup of hemp hearts. And we're gonna blend this up to create our spice, our sauce. Fourth a cup of hemp hearts. And turn this on. Okay, our pasta water is boiling nicely. So we also want to add a teaspoon of garlic powder, a fourth a teaspoon of pepper. Blend this up real quick. So we're going to strain and rinse. Then we're going to dump this in our bowl. You're going to take your Alfredo sauce that you had in your blender here. And we're going to pour that on top of our pasta. Mix it up real well. And this is really, really good. You could top it with some sauteed onions or mushrooms. You could top it with a little bit of parsley if you wanted. Some extra nutri nutritional yeast or salt and pepper. Uh, have a side salad, kale salad. And you have red lentil vegan Alfredo. And if you like this recipe, I have seven more recipes available for you. If you'll click on the link in the description, you'll get seven of my favorites, plus a grocery list and detailed instructions on how to create those favorite recipes in your own kitchen. And if you liked this video, please subscribe, click the little notification bell. You'll get notified every time I post a new video and give me a thumbs up. Let me know you like it. And if there's a recipe that you would like me to try, drop it in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you and I'll see you on the next video.